All right, everybody, welcome back. It is another Monday and another Mega Man Zero day. Hope you had a good weekend. And today we're doing more of this S rank run. Not a speed run. By golly, not a speed run. But a run for sure. Right. So last time we were here, we Yeah. Last time we were here we fought the Panther and we got the lightning ship. And that was a whole train situation. That took us like three hours or something. Hopefully this next area will take us a little bit less time. To read that. Uh, there is no way to exterminate all of New Arcadia. The rumor says that there is an arms factory in a city situated at about 100 kilometers north of our resistance base. We found the power reactor supplying electricity to the factory close to there. If we destroy the power reactor, we would be able to limit their number of enemies sold there. Yes. Good luck. Oh man, the music in this area. Daily. Thanks so much for the daily shadow. Also welcome. So this area is unique because uh, it has these bombs. And you actually have to use them to clear the area. This is an example, you can use it to break walls. Now, this is gonna make it tough as well because we cannot get hit by these. Oh, that's risky. Be very careful here. Oh, jeez. Okay. This area is also a nightmare. <clears throat> right, and we can just chill here and destroy this, I'm pretty sure. Get a cyber elf out of this. Uh oh, there we go. I need to break those top spikes. There we go. Ouch. We're already at half health, which is. Not the best. We also died. So, just find the quick way to die and then we can reset. Spikes do be the death, which is why we have to why we have to break them with the the bombs. Right, let's go. 
I will say this is technically a much longer area and there's so many much so many much yeah so much more room for error Uh, cause there's all these bombs and there's, there's also lava, other things, spooky things. You know what I don't know is if I'll have enough enemies bought by the end of this to get S rank. I should, but I'm not sure if I will. shots that and it's done. Some, some of them do take a little more than that, but since this is the first one, that's all it takes. Okay. Let's try to aim it better. Oh, that's messed up. bullets bounce. Yeah, they bounce up. There we go. It's still two hits. No reward there. <gasps> oh, I almost died. Okay. This one is tricky. You have to stay behind one of these, like, honey pots. Which, they're not really honeypots, they're more like... Lava pots. Oh, my bad. Uh, one of these... These bullets are faster, but... I think the final one of these is like jump rope, because when they hit the ground, they spread. They can't just, um, stand there. The war. This should be the final one. There we go. Now I don't know if this is the boss fight. Yeah, this is the boss fight. And this is actually the boss fight that reminded me of the Elder. The way around. The Elder rem reminded me of this boss fight. What the dog doing? How dare you fool around my area? I am Phoenix Magnion. Cool. You'll pay for this insult with my Phoenix Flame. I shall purify your evil mind with my flame. Cool. I get in the middle of that. They're reminding me of the Elder because of these things going up. That's pretty much the only reason. Ouch. Uh oh. It's safe to go here. Let's chill for a bit. more one more hit there we go i will be back again and again until you pay for your insult i wonder if he actually will i don't remember if he's actually back after this so let's see where our time was 
2020. Maybe? Heck yeah. An S first try. We take those. We do take those. We captured the EX skill of Phoenix Magnet. Hog. Thank you very much, Zero. Another concern has been handled thanks to you. Our operations are moving smoothly. I'm now very confident of our success. Hog. I don't know why that took so much less time than the train. Let's save. Process data, save data, save it here. And I think later I will clip the the whole uh, part that reminded me of the Elder. Because it's literally like, he only does it twice, the whole battle. And he would normally do it more times if the battle went longer, but it didn't. Right, so now Polar Cameras. As you can imagine, with the previous trends, one is lightning, one is fire, uh, and this one is ice. This mission is about sabotage. There is one of the computers in Antarctica which controls the defense system of New Arcadia. Didn't read that part. Uh, the defense of the enemy stronghold will be weakened, enough to carry out Operation Righteous Strike. Will you do this? Of course. Of course. Transfer start. The music again. The computer room of the facility. Once you destroy all of the systems, the abilities of the computer room will be weakened. Right, so these fishies are an issue actually. Oh, these are an issue too. Uh oh, yeah. Those are a thing. This is a little tough because the ice is very slippery. And taking damage from these fishies is unavoidable. What am I doing? I'm trying to die anyway. Let's go. Let us go. Oh, I did it. And it's funny because while I have invisibility frames, invincibility frames, I can walk on that for a little bit. But only for a little bit. Mission Polar Cameras. Transfer start. No, fish. Fish hurt. I'm already at like half health. Also, I don't take damage down here. Which is pretty pog. I should also switch to the fire element. Which, this is how that looks. Wham. And this is how this one looks. Wham. And also from the previous boss, I got this thing. Which... I'm pretty sure I could press control pad up. Okay. Ooh. That's pretty cool. 
I don't know if it'll be used or... Wow, they really do place that pretty well. Actually, yes, I think I do use this against some of the enemies here, so it's good to have it. Also, now I make it. Okay, I gotta die anyway. Wait, I have to die. I don't know why I even collected the ex why I even collected the extra life. About to go stream. Bye. No problem, Shadow. I'll probably make my way over there after I finish. Yeah, have a good stream. Fire elements and continue. You know, what I do like is that at the start of the actual mission, so before. You go to the mission, they tell you a summary of what you have to do. But at the actual start of the mission, they tell you exactly what you have to do. For example, uh, there are four cooling systems for the computer room of the facility. And to destroy all of the systems, the abilities of the computer room will be weakened. We have to find four thingies to destroy. Oh, I took fish damage. Let me actually equip the thing again. That's very useful. We need to nail this. Heck yeah. These are tricky. Yeah. Oh no. I've already taken too much damage. Yeah, thankfully these can't turn around. Also, tr getting turned into ice doesn't hurt me, which is great. At this point, let's just learn the area. There's no way we're passing it. Yet. Without, like taking damage. Well then. <laughs> this one is gonna be tough. It do be is gonna be tough. And I wish I could escape, but I cannot. I have to die. I think I have one more life, and if I don't, it's even better. Yep, one more life. Maybe I shouldn't grab the extra life that they're giving me. Because, like, it doesn't really matter, because I only have one life to pass these areas.
Right, so let's restart. Hmm. If that's the case, to make things faster, should I just drain my own lives to zero? Let's go to the sand wilderness. And we'll just um, get our lives to zero, because it doesn't really matter how many lives we have. That should leave me at zero. And now I can just escape and start our mission. to save my data to make my life easier. Right, so now if I die, I can just restart immediately and not have to end myself uh, more times. As for the free life that I get in the stage, I probably shouldn't get that. Because it would just make things more difficult. For cooling systems, uh, the hard part is getting, getting to the cooling systems without taking too much damage. Uh... Such a cool attack. Oh my gosh, did I just do that? I did that. I keep forgetting about that. I should consider just going into the water. I really should consider it. Consider it. Right, so here I can get away with just dashing. Those are cool robotic fish, by the way. Not even gonna lie. Oh my god, I took damage. So here we go into the water. We just kill these off, although they just keep spawning. But... Uh oh, okay. Invisibility frame saved me there. Get some life back. This is gonna be tough, not gonna lie. This area is not forgiving in the slightest. We could just, like, avoid some of these things. Speedrun style. Ouch. So it's not the wisest thing to do. Gosh. I've taken too much damage already, but at the same time, we'll see. Because of my runtime is better than my than my other things it'll make up for the points right 
So this is the first one. I don't know why I always have trouble getting out of this. Yeah, we've taken way too much damage, which is bad, but also we need to be able to get, we're, we need to get that Cyber Elf. We do need to get that Cyber Elf. Oh no. We high key, low key needed that Cyber Elf. Ouch. I'm actually low on life. I need that. I need a life crystal soon. Oh, thank you. There's a cyber elf up there as well that I didn't get. Which doesn't matter too much because... This is usually my point of failure. some serious damage. Right, so that's the last one. We have to time this correctly. There we go. Jeez. This is tough. Okay. You know, uh, in my first playthrough, I used um, the hook thing to get through those areas. And it was frankly just way too much. By the way, this is not going to be an S, but I just want to get to the end. <laughs> and then try to get the S rank. Oh, woo. You are the one. You're trying to destroy this and confuse us. Oh, woo. I won't let you do that. I'm guessing that the sound of him roaring, which like, yeah. Poor guy, he's getting wrecked. Jeez, <laughs> he didn't stand the chance. I can't believe this, I was beaten by this little bug thing. No way this is an S, dude. Actually? The damage didn't matter too much, did it? Interesting. Okay. So my runtime is actually making up for other things. That's really good to know. Yeah, no, we're not keeping that, obviously. We don't want an A, we want an S. Which we did get pretty close. Wrong way. Imagine doing that. Process data. Not save data. Load data. There we go. Jeez, dude. Right. So polar bear. Let's go. So we should just be speed running through everything uh but still trying to take as much a little damage as possible because our runtime is going to make up for uh, other things
We also should be getting the Cyber Elves that are like round. That are just chilling out. So these fish are not kind. So to prepare for these little machine gun thingies, I'm just going to charge up. There we go. There's another one right after this. This thing is here. This guy's here. I think there's one more machine gun guy below this. Yep. Had to prepare for that. What the fish. Let's not take unnecessary damage. From the fishies. We need the cyber elf. Right, I think this dude's gonna deal quite a bit of damage too. Uh oh. He's dead. So the, if I were to retry this, the game plan would have been to kill him before he does a second attack. No, we needed that cyber elf. Switch to our gun. That was another Cyber L. Maybe we can still get it. No, at this point it's not worth it. I think I could have made it there. Oh man. Maybe I, maybe I just should be using the hook there, because it's risky to not use the hook. Also, we gotta get them cyber elves. We are doing better though. Check on something. There we go. There are four cooling systems. Yes, yes, yes. Let's be careful here. These fish like to swim. Wow, that's a great start. I should have maybe dashed, but dashing gives me more height, which isn't pog. Let's go. Good luck indeed. Oh, 
Oh dang it. Alright, so no Cyber Elf for us. Which is bad. Dang it. I actually think getting the life, the extra life gives us points as well. Towards the end of our score. Oh jeez, too much damage. Ouch. Right, so you do have to spam A for that to work. Oi! Yeah, that's also a thing that is meant to happen. There's one more turret. Ouch. So at this point, I just need to not take any damage from the polar bear fight. I mean, from the from the ice golem fight. Jeez, dude, this damage is not okay. Just two hits, and he should be dead. There we go. does drop a Cyber Elf, but I want more Cyber Elves. Jeez. It should eventually float down to us. To the point, there we go. Let's switch to our gun real quick. There we go. Also, let's get this final Cyber Elf. Right. Oh my god, that almost killed me. So using the hook here is preferred. For a few reasons, mostly safety. Jeez, okay, I do need as much life as possible. Yeah, I don't even know how I made this jump before. Dude, we were doing so good. Uh, Sag. Big Sag. The spikes do be deadly. Right, let's go. Oh my gosh, okay. Gotta get those cyber elves. Oh 
yeah, let's just go down here. They hurt just from being near them. Many of them there. Og. at this point. No, 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 no. Is a dude close by? He is. Just one more push. This is not good. Oh my gosh. What have I done? Taking too much damage. Way too much damage. Yeah, my timing is off. This is like... During traffic where you hit like a bunch of red lights in a row. Where like a previous day you had hit all green lights. That's what timing does here. So this guy's dead. We're also super low on life. Which doesn't matter because the boss fight itself isn't that difficult. We just need to not make mistakes here. Ooh, that's a good chunk of life that we got back. Let's restart. No, 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 that's not die to this. Do this preemptively. We can always just go down when the time is right. Hopefully he doesn't respawn. Did not respawn. More damage than I would like. Literally, the only thing that can stop us now is tying to the spikes. Or this. Dying to the spikes would be worse. This is also a terrible attack. For me. Yeah.
I do dislike that the spikes one-shot you, and I can use Cyber Elves to increase my life to that to the point where the spikes only deal like a quarter of my health. But then the final score of the thing of the area. I don't know half the words in title. <laughs> Welcome back though. But I'm happy to be here. I'm happy you're here, Bunko. Welcome, welcome. We're doing a thing. This is an ancient... Not ancient game. Came out in 2003. Uh, but... This was one of the first games I ever had. I had this on my Game Boy Advance. As well as... Pokemon Red and Fire Red. So yeah. Wanted to give this old game a shot since Dark Souls wasn't cooperating and I needed to replace one difficult thing with another. How's your Monday? I mean, pretty good. Uh, I don't have much planned for today, so it's not a, not going to be a busy Monday, thankfully. GBA rules, yes. It do be. It do. I love Red and Fire Red, yes. I actually still have both I have my Game Boy and all the games, and everything still works. But I would cherish it forever. Yeah, I have the old, like, red cartridge, which is, like, huge, and then the smaller fire red cartridge, which is more normal. Oh, woo. You are the one. That's Pigeon. <laughs> yes, it is. You are trying to destroy this and confuse us, but woo. He's like an woo polar bear. Also, rep rest in peace, this guy. Like, he just cannot do anything, dude. Oh, never mind. He can do something. You had been here the first time I did this? He just couldn't move. It was more like that. No. Stop. Okay. <laughs> so that's a boss battle. Can't believe this. I was beaten by this little bug thing. Also, it's gotta be... an interesting death. If you just explode. Okay. Right. 14, 11. Ooh, this is gonna be bad. Oh. <gasps> I got an S. I just barely got it. A straight 95. For reference, uh, you can see all these things, right? Mission, clear time, enemy, damage. All these gather up points, and if you get a 95 or above, it's an S rank. Uh, elf refers to cyber elves, which are a thing in the game. There are collectibles and consumables. If you consume them, uh, you actually get points deducted from your score because they do power you up they do provide like permanent buffs uh, so it does just remove from your score uh, the retries are zero obviously damage is how much damage I take enemies are how many enemies I kill and clear time is just clear time so we get an ice chip and the EX skill of polar cameras which is a triple shot that's another cool thing about this game uh, the boss fights have- the bosses have different moves based on your rank. So if you're A rank and above, they will do like a super secret weird move, and that's the one they give you. For example, uh, you saw that he made a tower of like, ice, and it spread. Uh, let's switch to my buster shot. I'm sure this should- does it? I guess since I'm not shooting a an enemy, it doesn't show it. But these bullets do spread if they hit an enemy. I just cannot show it here because nothing is an enemy. Right, so let's go to Waifu. And save our game. I. Let's go. Just ignore that real quick. 
This is a legit Game Boy game. I got a capture card for my Game Boy Advance. Don't worry about it. Right. So the last boss for this section of the game is this dude. Which is how even? High Leg Arobuckle. Uh, which I'm sure is a reference to the Ouroboros cycle. Or the Ouroboros thing. Because this boy is a snake. In this mission, I'd like to, you to rescue our comrades. There are ruins known as Stasis deep in the forests. Scout soldiers who went there to investigate have not returned yet. I'd like to send someone to rescue them, but considering our current state of pre preparing for the coming operations, we don't have a soldier available. Very sorry to bother you, but will you find and rescue them? Yes. Gotta do it to them. And funny enough, uh, I do use fire for this area as well, which I used fire for the previous area because uh, he do be a polar bear. So the boss itself is weak to to ice, but fire burns the forest down. Commander sent us here to investigate something called a baby elf, but we encountered the Neo Arcadian army. My comrades are still somewhere in the forest. Please save them, Zero. So, Bunk Dome, are you familiar with any of the Mega Man games? Because I've only really played this series, the Mega Man Zero series. Uh, I'm familiar with X because of this. Uh, I'm fam familiar with the original Mega Man because of this game. But this is the only Mega Man type game that, that I've ever played. Uh, so the ruins are beyond this forest. Use the portable trans server and rescue the, ser the resistance soldiers who were lost. Will do. Right, so let's switch to fire. We can burn the forest down. Yeah. Ouch. So it do be speed run time. Not actually, but uh, the less time we take on this, the better our score. There are bees, not the bees. Oh god, not the bees. Ouch. The bees are not happy that I'm burning down their home. The, me the mechanical bees are not happy that I'm burning down their... Not artificial forest. We get a cyber elf. This is cy a cyber elf. Look at this thing. We got cyber elf bee shot. That's ironic. There are bees here. I get a cyber elf named bee shot. You know, funny thing, when I first played this game, I thought there was nothing beyond these first four stages, which is absolutely silly, because I could never get past this, because it's so tricky. Like, I couldn't reliably get through this, and it does take a little bit of coordination, which is difficult for, like, an eight-year-old. Take the free life. This do be a spider. Okay, I don't think we need fire anymore. Let's switch to ice. Oh man, I sort of want that cyber elf though. I can wait. Sticka. What's brown and sticky, am I right? Round and sticky, a sticker. Right, so this thing is is weird because it does things. That's the gist of it. This thing is weird because it does things. That's what the whole game is. You found the rare elf, elf zero. I'm. Uh, I guess I did. The boss said so. Waifu said so. Uh, thank you, Mr. Zero. The ruins are full of traps. Please be careful. Will do. Another guy here. I hope the others are fine. I hope so too, buddy. I mean, they'll be fine physically. I don't know about mentally. Alright, so let's get our hook back. Oh. Let's go. Hi. Thank you so much. I went too far and got stuck. It seems that way. 
right. Uh, let's see, we can make this. Nice. So what we just got was a an extra life thingy. And what that means is, since our life is already full, the next time we would... Wow, that just happened. The next time we would heal, uh, it goes to an extra like tank of life. And we can pull from that later. Right. Let's try that again. That is a long area. But speedrunning makes it feel a lot less of a long area. Go save the soldiers. So the music is absolutely bopping. Be sped. Uh oh. We'll just take this. Take these. No harm in that. Let's switch to a hook. That's a close one. Now we can actually switch to ice, but we won't switch to the buster yet. Because uh, we want to get a thing. Ooh. We are Spodermen. Now we switch to our... Buster shot for this specific like mini boss because that's what some of these are just a mini boss by the way those spikes automatically kill you so it is a little bit of a restriction switch back to the hook hopefully we don't die this time Okay. Hopefully we don't jump too high. This <gasps> wow, we did that. We just, we sure did that. Right. So our only mistake so far has been falling into the spikes, which is clearly enough of a mistake to end us. Let's go. We are speedy. Let's go. Much speed is required. And yeah, uh, I think the speed is more necessary in this case because in our final score, if we get under four minutes, I believe, we get 20 points instead of 15, uh, which those five extra points are huge because sometimes we take more damage than we should have and instead of 15 for the rest of the scores we get like 11 or something and it makes a huge difference 
The faster we go, the more we can guarantee an S rank. Also, the less damage we take, the better. But like, taking damage is just part of this. Hard to escape it. Especially with those small rat thingies. I think they were meant to get you by surprise. Ouch. So these dudes just have really good aim. Oh, one more cyber elf. We'll get these energy crystals as well. They aren't too useful yet, but in the future they will. time to get that cyber elf because the more cyber elves we get the higher our score not really but it helps our score Let's swing a little more there we go jeez I'm taking a ton of damage which is bad because the final boss is not very forgiving actually It's a little star laser he throws is not avoidable. But the little bomb that's bouncing on the spikes is avoidable because you can destroy it. Right, so let's be more careful around these spikes. Hi. Like that. The spikes are still our biggest enemy, and this always... What is this? There we go. This always causes me the most anxiety, this specific jump. Because Jesus. Because Jesus. Let's be careful here. Now we go. Yeah, this guy's traumatized, dude. Like, what would you do if, like, you're just stuck here? I mean, keep it. I am sad. I was spamming A through the text, and the text finished. And I jumped. Oh, buddy. Right, let's go. We haven't even met the boss yet, jeez. For reference, I don't think any of these bosses are too difficult. Especially not with uh, weaknesses. So the areas are always more difficult than the boss itself. There's a mole thing there. Ouch. So we can't really prevent the damage. Or some of the damage. Uh, a lot of the other damage we can prevent. Some of it though, we can't really stop. Bees. Not the bees. Okay, we get that. Oh, 
<gasps> oh, I almost did that. Okay, uh, I think I'm going too fast now. Small chance I'm going too fast. I am too sped for my own good. You're probably wondering, why am I not taking those floating platforms? Those are slower. In my opinion. Actually switched to ice here. Oh, I need the cyber elf. Free Cyber, I'll take that. Cyber Elf. I actually wonder if the dialogue here counts towards your time. It really shouldn't. chill here for a bit. Let's press B this time. There we go. I almost forgot about you. fight time. Give that back. Your life will be spared. Hiss. He says his. What are you waiting for? Run. Run. And there he goes. Hiss. This is a restricted area even for us New Arcadians. You will never leave here alive. But then why are you here though? Doot. Doot. That's my favorite thing about Mega Man games. Oh. How do I escape faster? Can I escape faster, please? Ouch. Ouch, the slinky, the slinky hurts use our life. Hopefully this is um, an S. If not, I'm a cry. Twenty, cool. Another twenty. A ninety-one. Dang it. Okay, I will be our B. You don't get to see this because we haven't. Oh. I'll just be RB.
All right, we back. Why is this not? Oh, right. There we go. All right, we back, we back. We do be, we back. Right. So, right, fire. Gotta do the thing. Actually, where are we at? Hour and 23 minutes. Almost hour 30. Hmm. I mean, should I stop halfway through? I have to wonder. And then just save the next area for the next episode. Excuse me. Ooh, an extra cyber elf. Take that. Oh no, the bees. Okay. So far, spikes has, have still been the enemy. Bikes are still the enemy. Am I getting a big enough swing? Just enough. Now we do this. Right. Now we know that the boss fight isn't going to be cool because the guy doesn't take elemental damage, so we have to just brute force him or get good. Two very different options. Ooh, I almost touched the spikes. Bit of extra life. Hi there. Wait, should I just go no element just in case? I think so. Give that back. 
do want it back. It's interesting because he looks like a cobra, but like he's on one foot. And then he's all springy. I guess it sort of makes sense. Good so far. Uh oh. Oof, okay. A no damage boss fight. Let's go. No, if only that baby elf wasn't stolen. I could have easily destroyed the nameless soldier. I'm the nameless, nameless soldier? Huh. I guess I do be the nameless soldier. Ooh, this has to be one of my best scores. A 97. X skill? Laser shot. Hot. That's it though? Just a laser shot? Oh. What's this? It's been a long time, Zero. X. X. But we can't see his face here. For some reason. You can see it in the the sprite, but not in the actual image. I can no longer rest. Both baby elves have awakened. The baby elves are still children. They cry for their mother as they tremble. And the loneliness. What's your point, X? The baby elves would do anything to reunite with their mother. Stir the human's mind and bring chaos. It's all to meet their mother, the dark elf. The Dark Elf that I sealed. The Dark Elf. The Dank Elf. Mission accomplished. We back. Well done, Zero. You've been very helpful. With your valuable cooperation, we've been able to retrieve another baby elf. We now have both baby elves at Neo Arcadia kept inside their vault. Once again, I'd like to thank you for your support. Og. Okay. So the new skill we got was the laser shot, which we can use with the buster shot. So when we charge it, it turns into a laser, which I don't know the use of. Look at that. Because normally, if I turn it off, it's just a big boy. It's just a, a whoosh. You know what I mean? Just a, a, a big old whoosh. But if I turn this on, it turns into a laser. Hue. And then if I change elements, it changes as well. There we go. For fire, it looks pretty similar, I think. For ice, it, it is different. Yeah, for fire, it looks pretty cool. Right. So that's going to be it for... For, for us today. I don't want to do too much in one stream. Or rather, I don't want to like try to overcommit to finishing the game. This stream. I want to sort of separate things a little bit more. But yeah. Uh, for now, that's going to be it. Thanks so much for going to stop by. I know it's a super super Juba. I know it's a super short stream, uh, but I made more progress faster than I thought I would. And yeah, that's a good thing. That is a good thing. So thanks so much for going to stop by. Uh, here is your daily reminder that you are loved and deserve all the respect. And I will see you guys next time. Let's find someone to raid and by find I mean let's let's raid someone um yeah let's go this way and I will see you guys there because I'm gonna be hanging out in the raid ease chat as well yeah bye bye